If you watch my video about transients and saturation, in which I duplicate a track, add a little bit of highs, and compress a lot, and then add a little bit of tape uh, to extend the range of the cymbals. Well, now I want to do more with River. For that, I picked this preset in Flex River from SSL. Turn down a little bit of the low end because I know it's gonna be a trouble when I add the bass. And now the the question is, uh, which track to add the the river? If if I add it to the normal drums. Instead, we do it to the super compressed track. It will sound very different. And in the first place, it's gonna sound sweet, but let's see what happens in context. Maybe the solution is a mix of blend of both and then turn down. The Who knows? So, for me, I want my rivers to be as natural as possible. So if you really need compression on your rivers, just add a little bit of after. In this case, if the threshold is all the way up, nothing is happening. Then if you want to compress, let's say, the RMS, and you maybe pick a, a slower ratio, and a medium release time, depending on the sound you are going after. Or maybe you want to, to just compress a lot the peaks in which case you just pick when something pick a high ratio maybe fast tag it's just exactly like a it's the same philosophy as in the channel.